So this video is about medication administration and for context, our patient has strep throat and he's just starting his first round of antibiotics. So the first thing we're gonna do is grab the physician's order and the MAR and we're gonna compare the two to see if, the, um, if they match. I've got the MAR here and the physician's order. So we're gonna look here, it's Plankton Plankton, that's his name, Plankton Plankton. And date of birth is January 1st, 2000 on the MAR and it's January 1st, 2000 on the physician's order. And I'm also reading from the MAR that it's, the prescription is penicillin V, 500 milligrams per oral every 12 hours for 10 days in tablet form. And I can see the same thing here on the physician's order. So now that we've checked the doctor's orders against the MAR, we can just look at the MAR now. So I just went to the cupboard and I found penicillin V 500 milligrams in tablet form, which is what I was looking for. The expiration date is good. It expires in 2023. We're going to do seven checks. So the right patient, the right dose, the right time and frequency, the right route, the right reason, the right medication, and the right documentation. So for the first one, for the right patient, we're going to look at the MAR. And this is a bottle, so it doesn't have his name on it. But we can see penicillin V 500 milligram tablet penicillin V 500 milligram tablets. So for the right dose, luckily this is 500 milligrams per tablet and that's what's ordered for this patient as well. So we don't have to do any conversions. So for the right time and frequency, it says here to take it every 12 hours for 10 days. And I've spoken to the doctor and I know that um, he has not had a last dose because we're just starting this medication. So for the right route, we're gonna check to see that these are oral tablets, which they are, and we're gonna check to see that it says per oral tablets on the MAR, which it does. So for the right reason, I've spoken to the doctor and we know that pen penicillin treats strep throat. So for the right medication, we're gonna check our MAR, again, penicillin V, and we're gonna check the bottle, penicillin V. And for the right documentation, after I administer the medication, I will document it. So for the second check, I'm gonna be doing the same thing as I did before, but I'm also gonna be pouring the medication into the cup. So I'm not gonna verbalize it like I did before, but I'm going to be checking right now the right patient, the right dose, the right time and frequency, the right route, the right reason, the right medication, and the right documentation. And I'm gonna be comparing this label to the MAR. So as I'm checking, I'm putting the medication in here. And this time I'm going to circle the medication. I won't sign it until after I give the medication though. All right, let's go check on Plankton. Okay, I'm doing hand hygiene, giving Plankton some privacy. And I've only brought over Plankton's medication. I've also got the MAR here, so I'm gonna verify his identity. Do you mind stating your name and date of birth for me? Okay, perfect. I'm just going to check your wristband here if that's all right. So it says Plankton, Plankton, date of birth is January 1st, 2000. Plankton, Plankton, January 1st, 2000. It says no allergies on the MAR and there's no allergies listed on this wristband. I'm going to teach Plankton about this medication and it would sound something like this. I've been told that you've had a conversation with the doctor about your diagnosis of strep throat. Is that correct? And has your pain changed at all or would you say it's still at about a five? I'd say it's still at about a five. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna give you some penicillin and strep throat is usually treated with this medication, which is an antibiotic. Antibiotics kill bacteria and killing bacteria will help ease the symptoms of strep throat and will help it go away a little bit faster. This medication begins to kill bacteria straight away and you should start to feel better in about a day or two. All right. Some people experience side effects from penicillin and some don't. Um, some common side effects are nausea, vomiting, having an upset stomach or diarrhea. If you do have side effects, they usually will go away after a few days or a couple of weeks. So I have your first dose here. One tablet should be taken every 12 hours for the next 10 days. Um, it's very important that you finish all of your antibiotics, even if you feel better, to make sure that all the bacteria is killed off. This medication can interact with other medications, vitamins, or herbs, but as you told me earlier, and I can see from your chart, you haven't taken any of these. Is that still correct? Yeah. Okay, awesome. Do you have any questions? All good. Then I'm going to give you this glass of water and your medication, and you're okay to take it on your own, yeah? All right, sounds good. Here's your water and your medication. And now that I've given Plankton the medication, I'm going to sign off on the MAR that I've done so. After about a day and a half of monitoring Plankton, his pain lowered to a 2 and he was discharged.